I don't know how you can be mad about a Monday when you get kittens brought in during work. This is Arlena Filippi from Mercer's Humane Society and we have three kittens here with us today named Monkey, Leo, and Tippy. And they're all so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't even handle this right now. Tell me a little bit about them. Um, they're <laughs> they're, they're eating like some chicken right now. <laughs> <laughs> they're loving it. Um, Hi, these kitty. guys are very, very sweet kittens that were fostered um, for a few months. They were found with no mama. Oh, so um, I believe these two are related to my fosters oh. and were bottle fed. Um, they're actually looking for their forever home. So if you guys um, have any room in your household or in your hearts for some loving kittens we've got plenty to choose from at work or at Royster's Humane Society. <laughs> um, this one's Leo and then this one over here is Tippy. And, and they're all boys or girls? Or? Um, this one's a girl. This, this one's, one's a, a, girl. Tippy's a girl. And Leo's a boy. 80% um, of orange cats are males. Which is so interesting. And yeah. then this little this Friend one, of ours. yep, that one is a boy. This is a boy. So, and this one was monkey. Am I right? Yeah. Yep. Monkey is so pretty. Look at that monkey. You haven't got much screen time. Look at that. <laughs> oh, so cute. This is too unbearable for me right now. I want them all. Um, and so they, you know, adopting a kitten is obviously a responsibility. It's not like adopting a puppy, though. They're quite quite easy in comparison to adopting a puppy. So if someone does want a pet, and say you're not home super often during the day, don't have time to really train a dog. These are a perfect option. Yes, they are. Um, for some little fluffy companions. Cats and kittens um, are very independent. They like to do their own thing, but they are also trainable. Um, we do kitten kindergarten classes, so we teach you guys how to um, do tricks, um, counter condition, leash train, so a lot of fun stuff that comes with the adoption. They are, and they are so cute. Oh my goodness, it's like a therapy session just having them in here. They make me so happy. And they're all available for adoption, right? Yes, they are current on all of their vaccines, except for rabies shots. Um, they are still a little too young for that, gotcha. but they um, are spayed and neutered and ready to go home and to be loved on and to be have that warm feeling of happiness at home. Just to have their person and their place. And I mean, I really can't thank Rosehurst enough because I adopted my kitten from you guys. And ever since I've had that little guy in my home, it is just so exciting coming home. And he's always really hungry, wants some food, wants to hang out. And so I just, I don't know. I think it has really opened up my home life and I absolutely love it. Now they are open starting tomorrow, so you guys could go check out these kittens. And how is kitten season going for you guys? Is it starting to finally dwindle down? Um, no, no. Not really. <laughs> we have a, a kitten room full of kittens, and then we still have more fosters coming in. So um, we have plenty to go around if you guys are having troubles finding some. Yeah. Um, come to us. These are the we ones to look for. Yes. They are so adorable. Thank you so much for bringing them in today, Thank Arlena. You. This is so much fun. If you guys want any more information, we'll have it all on westernslipnow.com if I don't steal them all from you right now. <laughs> <laughs>